Hello, 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 hello. I haven't been on here in a while for my group and for um, my uh, subscribers. But I had to come on today. I just really want to show you guys how to make something that I think that is absolutely gorgeous. Once you put the glitter to this or the glitter to any Betty Boop, it's going to turn out absolutely gorgeous, okay? I brought this off of Etsy. It's a place called Designs for Print. D-E-S-I-G-N-S-F-O-R-P-R-I-N-T. And he or she or whoever it is that owns the, the site, um, they make all of these little Betty Boop pictures and I have a friend that turns it into a SVG for me because I love glitter and I love putting glitter on my images. Some people like it, some people don't. I happen to like it and I think it's absolutely gorgeous which you will see after we get finished with this. I also have a lady that comes on here that always tells me I'm not going to the beginning and the ending of my videos and I want to tell you that when I get to certain parts on the video like the weaving I'm not going to show you every single piece that I weave for the simple fact that would take a long time I don't have the um, equipment to do a pause and speed it up and if I do have the equipment I just don't know how to use it right now so I'm showing you the best I'm doing the best that I can with the best that I have um maybe I'll get a loan somewhere maybe somebody can give me some money hand me down some money and maybe I can update my equipment but for right now I'm going to show you what I have I'm going to show you uh, the design. I'm using Cricut Design Space. I have already downloaded her. I hope you guys know how to download stuff to Cricut Design Space. If you don't, there's people on here that can show you how to go in there and um, download a file to Cricut Design Space once you buy the file. Okay, so I've already downloaded her, and here she is. I love her. She's uh, absolutely gorgeous. I am going to do her at 5002 for the width and 9.533 for the height. I'm not exactly putting her on something that I'm selling or anything. It's just that something I wanted to show you how to do it i'm not selling it or anything i'm just this is just a sample so it'll just be going on something like a a, a old t-shirt or, or something like that this is just the first part so this is where i'm going to be cutting her why does this everything looks crooked to me sometimes so i'm going to cut her at this side um all of these pieces over here is not how it really looks so now let's go we'll go and we're gonna make her she's already here she's a p and g when you buy her if you have to turn her into a svg you have to find somebody to do that for you because he only sells p and g's for sublimating to t-shirts to for sublimating to sublimated t-shirts okay so now we're gonna hit make it because I don't want this to last forever as well. Okay, when you go to make it, you're going to have seven pieces to cut. Um, the first piece is her eyes. And uh, a couple pieces that will go on her jeans right here. And these pieces right here, I'm going to cut that off. I'm not going to use these little pieces right here. I'm not going to use those. If you want to, you can't. It's up to you. The second piece is going to be two designs of her. You can use either one of these. 
I happen to use this one right here, the all black silhouette one. You can use either one. And then you'll have her eyes over here because you have to put in her eyes and stuff on here. And, you know, I just use the silhouette one. Okay. I don't use this one. I use the silhouette one. So it's going to cut this one out and I'm going to hide these pieces right here because I'm not going to use them. I want to hide all of these and I'll do that later because I don't want you to be on here while I'm trying to do all of that. Okay, the next piece is going to be the piece of her her face, her arms, and parts of her, uh, the holes that are in her jeans and a piece of her shoe. I'm going to do this in all sides are glitter. All of this is going to be sides are glitter. So this is going to be gold sizers glitter. Okay, the next piece and so I'm going to cut together just the lady, the person, the, the friend of mine that does these for me. He he does such a good job, uh, such a good job. Pieces are not everywhere. As you can see, it's only seven pieces. OK, and this is just going to lay in perfectly. It's going to lay into your uh, design perfectly. Then we have her earrings, her purse and, and her shoes. And then this right here is a piece of her collar. This piece right here is her shirt and um, pieces to her shoes, which is going to be pink glitter. This one is going to be like a reddish copper for her earrings, her purse, and that little piece down there, okay? And then, like I said, this is going to be pink glitter. This is her shirt and the pieces to her shoe. These are her blue jeans. You can make them blue. Or any color you want. You can make them any color you want. But I happen to. I'm going to make them blue. And then the last piece is her lip. Okay. Now what we're going to do now. Is I'm going to go over to my Cricut. And I'm going to cut all of these pieces out. I'm not going to let you sit there. And watch me cut all of these pieces out. Because that takes a lot of time. It takes a lot of time, guys, to do that because I don't know how to uh, fast forward or, or uh, do that kind of stuff. And so I'm going to um, cut this on my Cricut and I'm going to turn my camera on. I might show you me cutting it on the Cricut. I mean, I don't know what else to do. But, and I'll show you how the pieces came out after I cut them. I'll show you the pieces before I cut them. And um, that's about it. So I'll be back um, with the second part to this video. I will be back and show you how um, I did this Betty Boo. Okay, thanks for watching and please watch again.